writing something for us? I don't do assignments anymore. Yeah, but you're a better writer than most people do anything. Origin is a movie based on a best-selling book that links systems of oppression in the U.S., Nazi Germany, and India. It was written by the first black woman to win a Pulitzer Prize in journalism. Movie critic Gray Drake joins us now. Uh, so, should we see it? Should we skip it? How is it? Yeah, brace yourself for the first brilliant movie of the year. Mm -hmm. I have thought about this movie since I've seen it. I've watched it more than once because it's a unique adaptation. So Ava DuVernay took this book that sort of theorizes that America doesn't judge have a racism problem we actually have a caste system that no one knows about or really recognizes it's all kind of subconscious and what she did was made a movie about Isabel's life and everything that funneled into her creating that book mm -hmm. it's fascinating and Anjanu Ellis from King Richard who plays like Venus and Serena's mom right. in the movie she's great I have no idea why this isn't getting more award season mentions hmm. and it's a heavy movie it's, yeah. an, it's a smart like it. movie but yeah. i i just wish that people would take a chance on it is wow is it rewarding yeah. okay well I'll, I'll check it out because of you good yeah, <laughs> yes. uh, yeah really uh next up we have in theaters which brings me to you okay hard shift into a totally different lane where we're just talking about people who want to make out at a wedding okay. okay this is lucy hale from pretty little liars nat wolf from paper town and instead of making out at the wedding they decide they're going to download all of their previous relationships everything they've been through and air their dirty laundry up front mm. so it's kind of a walk and talk movie like before sunrise was a couple yeah. decades ago yeah. and if you love these two, then it's a great movie to watch. Well, I, I had fun. I like the opening clip that we showed when she says, I'll have cranberry on ice <laughs> and vodka. <laughs> <laughs> Eventually she's like, hold the cranberry. Let's be real. What's self-reliance? This is on Hulu. Right. So Jake Johnson from New Girl has directed this one. He's also starring as this guy who is told by two strangers that he has the chance to participate in a dark web reality show mm. where people are trying to kill him for 30 days and if he survives he gets a million bucks mm. so for all my paranoid friends out in the audience <laughs> this just justifies your whole life wow. <laughs> it's funny it's weird it's gonna keep you guessing I was rolling for this one a great directorial and debut a, for a, sure a good cast right it really like good Andy Samberg and Anna Kendrick other folks yeah. absolutely it's yeah. really really worth your time and a great reason to pay you know a monthly fee for Hulu well, Hulu has a lot of good stuff they really do yeah they do okay so it is January the 19th which means it is National Popcorn Day. Of course Day. it is. Who knew? Yes. Who knew? <laughs> oh, my we, God. We don't have, we have everything but the popcorn. Yep. I know, yeah. right? I'll tell you who knew. It's the Cinema Foundation and Fandango, and there's, <laughs> there's still time to get your deals today in theaters, okay? So every theater all across the country, they're having deals for this, and, you know, you just get popcorn for, like, less than potentially what it normally costs, right? <laughs> so, it, so, it, so, it's, so it's like five yeah. bucks instead of ten? Maybe so. Maybe so. Yeah, know, so. The, all, the de all the deals vary from place to place, but it's a great way to celebrate essentially what is our number one concession yeah. Yeah. all over the country. And our number one markup. Think about the cost <laughs> versus what That's it right. we got to keep the right? theaters in business so, yeah, somehow you gotta for crying out loud. got to keep it going. Uh, what a week for you. Uh, <gasps> the Emmys were on Monday. Critics' Choice Awards on Sunday. You were a member. You were yes. sitting with Paul Giamatti. Oh, Tell us about uh, your night with the holdover crew. Okay, so Professor Paul in the movie is such a crank, and Paul Giamatti could not be more different. He is genuinely patient and kind. He filmed a video oh. roasting my family for me. <laughs> oh, that's so oh. sweet. He is the best. It was so great to see him win, and he fully acknowledges that the internet just wants more photos of him eating. In and out? Yeah. Yes. He just, anything I said, I was like, listen, I'll take a picture of you right now, Paul. Let him go viral <laughs> like that. Um, I was exciting to see everybody there, as always. Oh, Some really good winners that were really echoed in the Emmys the next day. Succession, yeah. Beef, yeah. The Bear, these are our shows. And, and the Emmys was well done, too. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. I really yeah. appreciated, yeah. like, all the reunions. It felt reverent of TV. Because, which, believe it or not, I like TV, too. Okay. <laughs> Me, too. Just, kind of, they've kind of movies. melded at this yeah. point. All right. Uh, great. Good to see you. Have a great weekend. Thank you.